Hi, today I would like to make some fish kebab. Right here I have a wild catch salmon. I cut it in slices and I washed it. Fish kebab. I'm gonna start with lemon juice. I use the two tablespoon of lemon juice and I'm gonna add some salt as much you like a pepper as much you like I'm gonna put one teaspoon of onion powder half a teaspoon of onion powder half a teaspoon of garlic powder I'm gonna add a saffron this is a buru saffron and I'm gonna do enough to each piece have a decent amount this is about two tablespoon of brew saffron i have like one tablespoon of chopped parsley and this is my marinated mix gonna be complete with canola oil this is GMO free canola oil and I'm gonna do two to three tablespoon in it I'm gonna mix it make sure every side have nice spot of flavoring for the look I like to put a little red flag in it to make it look prettier red pepper flag I really like it for a look Persian normally don't put the red flag in their fish kebab but I like that little red spot in it you're gonna go in the refrigerator I'm gonna cover the lid with the plastic put them in the refrigerator 15 to 20 minutes I'm gonna make sabzi polo and I'm making them in a rice cooker each rice cooker come with a cup this measuring cup is different with the regular measuring cup. I use this, so I put two cup of basmati rice here, and I wash it with the cold water until it got clear. It take like a three or four times, you have to rinse it until it would be clear like that. And I add, again from the same cup, three cup of the water into it. I plug them in and I'm gonna add salt as much I like how do you know how much you like is after you add a little salt you mix it you test the water and um, <clears throat> you test it until you know that is salty enough for you some people like more, some people like less. Hmm, it's fine for me right now. Uh, I use myself like a one teaspoon of the salt. And then I'm gonna add organic canola oil in it. It's a one, two, and the tree 
later on I'm gonna add some butter when I am adding my green herbs so I'm gonna put any other video I have I put the paper towel put the lid on I'm not gonna have a tadik so I'm gonna put them on the 20 minutes and I wait to the most water evaporate and then I'm gonna add my mixture of the herbs my mixture of the herbs I use it dry because it makes my job easier and it's faster herbs in this cup it's parsley cilantro chive and dill okay let's check the rice see the water being evaporated now it's the time to add my green herbs I'm using a dry because it's make it faster uh, but it would be really delicious it would be very delicious if you use the fresh herbs but if you use the fresh herbs you have to use more I am using one third of the cup same cup which I measure the water and rice two large garlic finely chopped using a fresh garlic I'm gonna add two to three tablespoon of unsalted butter really like to have a lemon juice in my herbal rice or sabzi polo put this bag and wait to those herb grab the moist and get ready this is, is almost the end of the cooking time. It will separate from the pan when it's ready to flip. I really like the skin of salmon. It's a very high nutrition in there. I'm gonna serve this with the herbal rice. Okay, the rice is ready. The rice cooker turn off itself. I'm gonna add some more butter. You could do one or two tablespoon really like this dish with more butter in we're gonna add brew zafra Persian believe zafran served with the rice it balanced the nature of the rice they said the herbal medicine said rice is a cold nature if you add the saffron it would balance it ancient persian were all about eating a balanced food i guess that's why they were healthier <laughs> my fish kebab and sabzi polo is ready i'm gonna try it mm. It is very nice. Look at that. Isn't that pretty?
I'm gonna try the fish with the rice. Mmm. Mmm. Very nice. You really should try. Especially if you like fish. The herb and the garlic and lemon juice and the butter. Great combination. And then the zafferani and kebab fish. Very nice. Thank you very much for watching and let me know what you think.